Hey, good afternoon, Donna. This is Ryan over at Five Knots Digital Marketing here in Port St. Lucie. Uh, like I mentioned to you on the phone earlier today, I just wanted to shoot you guys over a quick little custom video, just some tips and tricks that you guys can take and even start implementing even as soon as today if you wanted to start getting some more notoriety on Google, to start being found and, and have your uh, web page found on Google so that you guys are bringing in some more leads and some more business. So I don't want to waste a ton of your time. So without further ado, the three things we're going to discuss is your content, citations, and backlinks. And your content is anything on the home page, including images and how these images are saved and what's behind the images. And Google wants to see about 1500 words of content on the home page. And they want to see that for a couple of reasons. Number one is that they want to see that you guys are the true authority in the space, whether it's for roofing in Stewart or roofing in Port St. Lucie or whatever location you guys are trying to target. They want to see that you guys are truly the authority in the space. So they want to see definitions, explanations of your services. They want to see some of the keywords and keyword phrases that people are using to search for your services online. And the second thing that that does referring to keywords is it allows you to get some more information in here so that, again, people are finding your website when they go to search in specific keywords and keyword phrases, especially buyer intent keywords that'll bring you guys leads. They want those keywords to be found here on your home page. So while the website does look nice, it's very clean, it's very simple. Um, there's some great imagery. The key here, the key takeaway here is to add some more content, explaining your services and allowing you guys to put in some more keywords and keyword phrases. Okay. And the second thing we're going to discuss is your citations. And your citations is just as simple as your business name, your address, and your phone number as it appears in the different directories online. These directories include Angie's List, Yelp, Thumbtack, even Facebook. So the goal is to get listed on as many directories as you guys can find so that you guys are being found higher in the Mac Pack section so that when we go over here to Google and we type in Roofing Port St. Lucie or even Roofing Stewart or anywhere else, that you guys are being found here in this map pack section. Okay, this is what we refer to as the map pack. And 80% of individuals, when they go to Google, no matter what service they're searching for, 80% of those individuals are going to click on a company in one of these top three spots. They look at it as, well, they have reviews, they're trusted by Google, so obviously I should be able to trust them too, right? So if you're not in this top three section and you're down here um, further down on the map listings, whether it's the, even the first page, but maybe 10th or 12th position or the second page, you guys ever, and everyone else down here is left fighting for the 20% scraps that are left um, after those individuals have already looked at the top three companies in the map pack section. So building up those citations is gonna help get you guys listed higher in this map section. Down here is what we refer to as the organic searches and building up that content on your homepage adding in those keywords and keyword phrases, and then as well as building up your backlinks, which we'll get into here shortly, is what's gonna ultimately rank you guys higher in this organic section. Now, as far as your citations go, I pulled up your company here, Brilliant Roofing, and this citation finder I use called WhiteSpark. It's a pretty helpful paid tool I use, and it shows you guys right now have 11 citations. So that's ultimately with citations, you wanna get above and beyond what your competitors have. So after doing some research, I found that most competitors have 15 to 25 citation sources that they're utilizing. So you guys would want to bring this number up from 11, well past the 25 that's an average number for your for roofing companies in the area. So with citations, you don't want to just you know match what your competitor has. You want to go above and beyond and get listed in many more places than they are. So whether that means you have to go up to 30 or 40, maybe even 50 citations, it'll ultimately be worth it to get you guys ranked higher in that map pack and bring in some more business for the company. And the last thing we're gonna discuss is your backlinks. So a backlink is just as simple as site A pointing to site B, giving site B power. So Google looks at it like a popularity contest, okay? They want to see that you guys are partnered with the popular kids in the roofing industry. So whether that's a roofing supply company or other installers or other companies that perform your same services, they want to see that you guys are getting those backlinks from reputable, not notable companies that are in, this, in the space. So they, Google doesn't necessarily want to see that you know, you're getting a backlink from, let's say, a, um, 
lawnmower repair company up in northern Michigan. While it doesn't hurt to have as many backlinks as possible, not all backlinks are created equal. So you want to make sure that the backlinks you're getting are reputable <clears throat> reputable companies that have to do with the industry you guys are serving. And obviously, in this case, it's roofing. So I compared you guys to, again, your competitor was, uh, your top competitor on the Google searches is, is Hammer Roofing. Now, they pulled up number one in the map pack for a Port St. Lucie search, as well as the Stewart search. So right now, you can you can really see why. They have 161 backlinks. And that's not a totally unattainable goal that's very possible to get you guys to that number. It's just a matter of building out the links and getting you listed in these different referring domains. And that's going to ultimately build up your traffic in the organic searches and also help out with you guys getting listed higher in that map, map pack section. So the next time that anyone comes over here and says roofing company Port St. Lucie or roofing estimate Port St. Lucie, roofing estimate Stewart, Florida, you guys are going to be in this top map map section right here so that you guys are ultimately getting the calls, you guys are getting the requests for quotes, and you guys are getting the business coming to your door. So to recap everything we discussed, the key takeaways are building out this website a little, a little more robustly so that you guys can add in some more copy and some more keyword phrases, keywords to add in some higher level of content on your website, on the homepage, Second thing is build out those citations so that you guys are blowing your competitors out of the water. So we want to beef up 11 citations up to probably 20 or 30 citations to compete with all your competitors. And then the final thing is building up those backlinks. And 59 is a good start. That's a great start. But you want to build that out a little higher. Make sure those companies you're getting the backlinks from are reputable companies in the space. And that'll ultimately give you guys the power and popularity that Google is looking for when their algorithms go in and crawl your page. So again, Donna, I really appreciate you taking my call earlier. I appreciate you guys taking the time to check out this video. I know you said you're not probably interested in dealing with any marketing changes until next year, and that's fine. This is honestly just a helpful little tip video that you guys can start doing even as soon as today that's gonna improve your marketing. So if you found the video helpful, I'd love to hear your honest feedback. All my contact information will be in the email signature attached with this with this video when I send it over. Uh, thank you guys so much. Enjoy the rest of your week, and I hope to talk soon.